I'm Mike Hart. Here is a look at what we're following on this Monday. The U.S. Navy has identified the pilot that was killed after his fighter jet went down in the Mojave Desert on Friday. Officials say Lieutenant Richard Bullock went, uh, crashed his F-18 Super Hornet near Trona, just east of Ridgecrest. Bullock was based at the Naval Air Station in Lemoor, about 200 miles away. Naval security forces responded to the crash site, as did fire crews out of China Lake Naval Air Weapons Station. Officials say Bullock was flying a routine training mission before he crashed in a remote, unpopulated area. No other people were involved. The cause of that crash remains under investigation. Meantime, the primary elections are tomorrow. You can still drop off those mail-in ballots. There are four drop boxes in Bakersfield. We also have sites listed in Arvin, Cal City, and Delano right there on your screen. You can also take your ballot to any polling site in Kern County to drop it off on Election Day. All right, now let's turn our attention to the forecast and the hundreds are on the horizon. Good morning and get ready for a hot week. For our Monday today, we're in those upper 80s, so not too bad compared to the rest of the week. Getting into those 90s starting tomorrow, even seeing triple digits on Friday going into the weekend. Sunday, a slight dip, but still pretty hot, just under 100 degrees in those upper 90s. Our mountains are a little more comfortable today in the 70s and 80s. Same thing, though, like the valley, though, where we really warm up going into the rest of the week. Tomorrow through Thursday, 80s and 90s, getting into those 90s on Friday, going into the weekend for Tehachapi and Fraser Park, expecting 100 degrees degrees on Friday for Lake Isabella. Going into Saturday, a tiny dip only by a few degrees, a slight more of a cool off on Sunday. Still definitely hot out there, but on Sunday we're more in those lower 90s for Lake Isabella. Touch me and Fraser Park will drop to a little more comfortable temperature in those lower 80s. And that's a look at some of the stories we are following at this hour for breaking news, weather and traffic anytime, anywhere. Download our free mobile and tablet apps. Have a great day.